it is neither possible nor useful for a country to provide university education to a higher proportion of young people to what extent do you agree or disagree i have underlined some important words in this essay prompt so for university education you can use different synonyms in your essay like for university education you can use tertiary education because if you will use university education again and again in your introduction body paragraphs and conclusion then it would not be good for your band scores so for university education you can use this synonym tertiary education higher education college education and you see tertiary education and tertiary education first tertiary education was used in introduction then in body paragraph so repetition is not good for your band scores but you can use a uh, like one word in your introduction and body paragraph like two or three three times maximum but try to use only two times okay so now you know synonyms for university education tertiary education higher education and college education for high proportion you can use scientific proportion this word also means big and for young people you can use youngsters because these are important words in your essay prompt and these words you have to use these words in your uh, introduction body paragraph and conclusion so try to use synonyms if you will write young people young people in introduction in in body paragraphs in conclusion then you will not get 7 7.5 or 8 band scores in your writing you will get 5.5 or 6 okay so these words like synonyms and your vocabulary is very important and topic related vocabulary words they are very important for the band scores so now look at an introduction I completely agree with the given statement that providing tertiary education to a vast majority of youngsters would be neither achievable nor advantageous. There are a number of arguments to support my opinion which I shall discuss in the upcoming paragraph. So our first body paragraph is Undoubtedly encouraging everyone to enroll in university would push more people towards lucrative professions such as medical engineering and law these positions also provide great social status moreover it would benefit the entire nation not just the individual students who take advantage of it a better educated workforce would get high paid jobs and thus help the economy from growing faster However, it is easy to see why it would not be realistic for the government to provide higher education to a gigantic proportion of youngsters. If most youngsters go for higher education on government funding, it would be a lot of added burden for the government to sustain the long run and ultimately people would have to pay much higher taxes. Moreover, also use these type of words connectors, okay? However, moreover, moreover, students may not take college education too seriously if they don't have to pay for it. And this is a conditional sentence. If they, so your essay should be a mixture of complex sentences, compound sentences, conditional sentences, and simple sentences. Try to use connectors. Okay. so these things are really important look so for the above reasons so and then comma then so try to practice practice uh, 
to make these type of sentences just simple sentences uh, if you will write just simple sentences then you will get 5.5 or 6 not more than that so if you uh, if you will write all these type of sentences simple sentences compound sentences complex sentences conditional sentences then you would be able to write a beautiful essay okay furthermore okay however moreover furthermore it would also not be gainful for a huge number of young people to get higher education it may seem surprising but tell me this sentence is a complex sentence or a compound sentence do you know this sentence is a complex sentence or a compound sentence tell me write in comments that which type of sentence is this but it is true that higher education leads to unemployment the expectations from jobs increase with the level of education and so many fresh grads do not settle for jobs for which they consider themselves overqualified for instance a specialist in plastic surgery so this is the example okay you can use for example or for instance and you can give any example to support your opinion now conclusion to sum up i reiterate my view that it would neither be realizable nor profitable for the government to send a majority of young people for higher education.